Those four are the major characters in this story, but this guy right here, he's another one. This is our tiny rental shack. We try to do as much work to it as we can without putting too much money into it, but it keeps us busy, especially right now. And right now, our lives really haven't changed that much other than the fact that I don't physically go into school. I still keep busy enough with all the online schoolwork. And my wife, she's actually an x-ray tech, so she still goes into work. And sure, we wear masks when we go to the store for groceries, but we're kind of homebodies anyway, so we do tend to stay at home for the weekends and uh, for date night, we end up just going through a drive through somewhere. And maybe this time last year, we would have been thinking about planning a trip somewhere, but with a baby on the way, we've got plenty of other things to worry about. And like I said, school's been moved online, so this is what most of my lectures look like. Taking it all in in the comfort of my own home. And when it comes to the screenwriting class, we meet up online to read it together. Another thing that's different, doctor's appointments, self-care and grooming. Some leisure activities though are pretty much the same. Maybe I get a little bit too much time to do this one though. And when it comes to the socializing part of this whole thing, our homebody tendencies are actually really liking this new norm. In fact, we hadn't seen these friends since last year, so we're actually seeing more of our friends than we would have before. So while we do want everything to go back to normal, we are enjoying this time to catch up on projects and to keep ourselves busy and at the same time slow down and realize what's most important in life. Those closest to us, those far away from us, and those who are getting ready to come into this world. Also remember that you don't have to be doing something productive every single day. Some days are just meant to be lazy. So whatever the rest of 2020 has in store for us, just try to relax like Butters. That's all he ever does. Or just try to have fun like these two. Try to find joy in the simplest of things. Try to take advantage of those sunny days. Get outside and do something. Or don't. Just remember to smile like this cup of coffee.